Hello my YouTube friends. Um, yesterday I was putting gas in my car on my 1997 Hyundai Accent and it smelled like gas. I thought it was the gas station. So I woke up this morning and I was curious. I said, you know what? Let me check. It could be something else. And this is what I found. <sighs> the clamp that goes here that holds the hose, it was gone. So I had to go to work, so I put this plastic thing te temporary just to hold it for it won't go away from the filler for where you put the gas at. But I think that's a mistake because it still smells like gas and you can see that, let me see if I can show you, there's gas here, there's gas all over. Let me just point down, oh you can see it from the bottom. See all that gas that's coming out? So that plastic thing, it was not a good idea. And you can see that it was coming out from here. So my recommendation, just don't drive it like this. If this happens to you, don't put this plastic. The best thing is to put the metal piece like down there. And I didn't have the metal piece and I had to go to work and I put this and I put this just to hold it down and I think it was a mistake because look at this gas, you know, that's coming out. I'm gonna go get the metal piece and then I'm just gonna show you how to put it where you can see how it's coming out from here. Cause that means the, when you press the gas, the pressure and all that, I'm gonna have to push it in and put the metal piece. So, you know, people tell me to sell this car, but I, I love this little car and this car, you know, doesn't cost much to fix. And it's little things. This metal piece only costs maybe like three dollars or something. I'm just gonna get it, you know. I just put this temporary, and you can see, you know, that it's loose. So I'm just gonna go get the metal piece, and I'm gonna show you how how to install it, how to put the metal piece. I'm gonna have to take this out, right? Take it out, put the metal piece, and then put it in, and then just tie it up. So if your car smell like gas, just you know, um. Don't take it for granted, just check because you know you never know what it is in this situation. I put gas on my car and it smelled like gas after it was the gas station. And this morning I was curious to check and I seen that the whole metal piece was gone that holds this hose. And I, I'm glad I checked because I probably would have been driving, I probably would have been throwing gas all over the place. And you can see, even with the plastic thing, there's gas all over the place here, there, and here. So once I get the the metal piece I'll show you how to install it thank you for watching okay my friends I'm back and I bought these right here from AutoZone got the clamp this is the clamp that broke so like I put this we're gonna have to cut it so when you cut it just be careful that you don't cut the holes I don't think it's a good idea to put these um these fasteners, these things here to hold it, not for gas. So you just want to cut it. Taking my time because I ain't trying to cut the holes. Now, you want to put a screwdriver around here because you need to take the holes out. So let's take your time. Put a screwdriver because you're trying to take the holes out. Yeah, it was leaking a lot of gas. I don't even know what made me think to put that in there. I guess and you just want to. Take your time pulling it. There it goes. Yeah. And clean it up. 
Clean all the gas up. Yeah, it's coming out a lot, you can see. Man. What was I thinking of putting that plastic thing in there? I guess trying to get to work, right? Clean it up real good. Then you want to take the clamp, put the clamp here. Make sure you put it in this way for you can be able to um, screw it in. I push it all the way in. Hopefully you can see what I'm doing. Push it all the way in. It has a mark there, so push it all the way in. See. Make sure it doesn't come out from the other side. That's pretty good on the other side. Yep. Sure. Take your screwdriver. Thing is, I, I thought it was the smell was the gas station, cause you know the gas station smell like gas. And me being curious, like Curious George, said this morning, you know what, let me check. I got under the car without lifting it up and I saw that the clamp was in there. So I just put that plastic in just to hold it down. And to my surprise, all that gas was coming out through here. So it's not good to put the place, better to park the car. Park the car and make sure it's nice and tight. You don't want to tie it so much that you're gonna go through the holes. <laughs> That's good enough. Tomorrow I'll check it again just to make sure. I'm gonna clean all this gas over here. Make sure you clean all the gas. Oh, no. I am not selling my car. I love this little car. My daughter loves this little car. This car doesn't take much to fix. It's little things. What I'm paying to fix this car is less than I was paying a month for that least Hyundai Sonata I had. I love this car. I mean, easy, it's easy things to fix. These are easy things that I can do myself. So here you go, my YouTube friends. If, if you have, if you're gonna go get gas and it smells like gas around, just take a look. You don't have to jack up the car, go under the car, see if there's any leak in the hose, in the fill up right here where you fill up the gas, make sure it's not cracked down there. You can't see it on there, but you wanna check in there where the hose go at to the gas tank. You wanna check everything. In this situation, it was easy because I just went under the car and I saw that the metal piece was gone. So once again, this is now Mechanic. Thank you for watching.